Stevies, welcome back for another video. So if you guys are watching this video, it is because you have a analog speedometer tachometer 5 inch from Harley Davidson. And let's say that you have this on a used bike and you don't even know what it can do. Let's see, 600 different color options that you can do to this speedometer. And if you've got it used, you don't even know you can do it. So we're going to show you how to change the colors on it right now. So if you buy a bike used and it has a speedometer on it, you guys might not even know what it's capable of. Starts off cool, different color options. I have mine to white with red gauges, with red needles. Um, because I have a red bike now, my old bike was blue with red needles and I really, really liked it. But the, at nighttime, <laughs> you get the uh, reflection up on your handlebars and you think there's a cop behind you. Like I said, right now I have mine to white and red. How you change that is, you shut your bike off, everything goes out. Turn it to accessory, everything stays on. Now let's see if I can do this with holding the camera. Both blinkers at the same time, hold them down. And you will go to setup. Setup on. Okay, so now you can change each individual thing and it shows you each time. Speedo, you can change the speedo. These are the needles. The LCD, you can change it separate. The dial, you can change it separate. Or you can change them all at once. We're going to change them all at once at first. You can change the brightness. You got your uh, gear indicator. Turn that on. Okay, so we're going to go to all. And let's hold down both blinkers again. Okay. Now it gives us a color number. And the color numbers, we're going to hold the button down. We're going to go through them all. See, we're going to greens now, it looks like, in the hundreds. Blues in the two hundreds. I kind of like that aqua blue. Here's a dark blue. Now we're into purples. And then reds, now we're into whites. Start over again at reds. I do know that number one, because that's the number of my needles right now, Number one is as red as you can get it. And I actually really, really like that now. Hmm. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to redo mine because of this. I like this better. So each color, we're going to do this one. Hold both blinkers down. And right now, we are changing the needle color for the tachometer. You know what? We're going to make this needle white. All the same colors for each thing. And I know white is the very last number. 599, 600. Zero is red, zero, 600 is white. We're going to hold both buttons down, both blinkers down, saved. Okay, so now we're on speedo. Hold both buttons down. And the speedo speedometer needle, let me change that to blue. So 300, I believe, is blue. Yeah, that's like a purple now. So we're going to go back to 300 because I think that's the bluest blue that you can get. Well, 310. We're going to leave that. Hold both buttons down. Saved. <clears throat> LCD screen. Uh, let's make the LCD screen. 
We're at 600. There's red. I might do red. I'll leave that red for right now. Okay, the dials. I think you have to do both dials. Yeah. You can't just do the tack dial and the uh, speedometer dial, but we're going to do these dials here. I may leave it like that right there. So we'll save this. We'll hold both blinkers down again. We'll save it. And it says saved. Save dial. Okay. So now we can do all. We can do our brightness. Pull that down where it dim. Hold that down. Bright. So there's bright and dim. There is no in between, it looks like. Yep. So we'll go bright. I like the red. The red is easy on the eyes. That's why I like the blue also. The blue is very easy on the eyes. I don't care for the, the yellow that the original speedometer was, which is what that is. Which I do believe I have a remedy for that now. I'm going to take that gauge off. I don't need it because there is a gauge in this. Um, so let's see. I saved everything there. Yep, it went back to that. So we'll turn the key on now. We'll go through all the colors. Run the needles through to make sure they work. And now we're at red with a blue needle and a white needle for the tack. So that's what the number that I that's what I used to have on my old bike, and I really really like that. But my bike's red now. My old bike was blue, so I'm probably not gonna do that. But here's the thing that messed with me the most: you thought there was a cop behind you all the time. Red lights, red and blue lights, huh? When you're on the interstate, red and blue lights glare off the windshield. See what I'm getting at? <laughs> yeah. Speedometer fades out. Turn the ignition off. Turn the ignition on. There you have it. I'm going to go with that for now. I don't know if I'll go with that forever, but that's what I'm going to go for for now. So everybody, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more stuff like this, subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And until next time, everybody stay cool and when the weather's warm. We'll see you on the road.